Daddy? Daddy? Dad! What's up now? How do you make and use the differential opinion setting tool? Oh, whatever happened to the days when children just wanted to know where babies come from? Hello, I've been asked by a friend to make a differential opinion setting tool for him and I thought I'd share it all with you. First of all, get about 11 inch of good smooth straight iron bar. It needs to be straight because it's the straightness of the bar when you put it in the gearbox that ensures the accuracy of the measurement you're taking. Then, just half inch off centre, and I'll explain the reason for that later, I've drilled and threaded a 3 8 UNF hole. Put that in the vise. Then, get a short UNF bolt with a nut on it, and you can see I've ground the top of that flat, get rid of all the little markings so you can get a good measurement. And we screw that in there, like that. And then we have to set it to the correct measurement. And if we look in the book here, under data, we can see that the measurement from the forward edge of the differential pinion bore to the ground face of the pinion is 1 inch 180 thou. So we need to set that now. Oops, dropped it. First thing we do with a digital vernier is measure the bar and then zero the vernier. So we've took the diameter of the bar out of it. Now we can measure the difference between the back of the bar and there. And we've got one inch, 126,000. So that needs to come out a little bit. Let's try again. 1198. Screw it in slowly. There we go. 1.18 inches and then we can just lock that up with a spanner and check it again 1.179 that's good enough for me right now we've set the tool we have a look at how we use it and if we go back to the book again this circle here is where the differential carrier bearing fits and we put the tool across that aperture to the same aperture on the other side with the uh, bolt head sticking forward to touch the differential pinion to make the measurements. And it works like this. Here's the differential pinion and as you can see we've got this little spigot in the middle and that's the reason that my uh, bolt for measuring is off centre. You put that in the gearbox across the apertures and it just touches like that. If it doesn't touch or it's pushing this too far back, you then adjust the centre bearing of the gearbox. You adjust the centre bearing of the gearbox to move the pinion backwards and forwards so that it just touches the tool that you've made. And that's how you make the tool and how you use it. Happy tractoring everybody.